Oh, here we go. Yep. Yeah, Joffrey's wondering, like, dude, what's going on? Uh oh, Rita's witnessing this. Wait, Rita, you were just beating him up too! You literally just beat him up! Do you want a chance to win a free stuff pack, game pack, or expansion pack? Well, all you have to do is like this video, find the secret comment that's hidden in the video, and leave it down below in the comment section. Now, you can do this every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Every time we upload, you have a new chance to win. And on Sunday, we announce the winners. So stay tuned, make sure you subscribe, turn on notifications so you never miss any of our videos. Do you guys remember Marcus Flex? You may remember Marcus Flex from a couple of days ago when Darian Hayes took a chainsaw to Marcus Flex's abdomen and sawed him in half on the sidewalk during broad daylight. Yeah, that's right. Darian Hayes is a psychopath and he's a come upper in this city, okay? Newcrest is a buzz that there's some crime trickling around its city and that one person uh, in specific, Marcus Flex has gone missing, and the town's looking for him, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna read, uh, Marcus Flex Stone, just so everyone knows the message we're trying to send, okay? So we're gonna get Darian over here to read the stone to you guys, because it's got a very powerful message, and the message is, don't mess with the Hayes family, or you get Flexed on Marcus Flex. Now I know Marcus didn't mess with our family, but we had to set an example. Set a tone. What was that? Oh, there's some weird stuff going on in there back here. We had to set an example and set a tone. Now that we do have a family, obviously over here we have Rita. Hello, Rita, our lovely wife. And then our brand new baby daughter, Rosa. Okay? Rosa is not gonna take no crap from nobody. <laughs> The baby. Can babies kill people in The Sims? I mean, I find myself asking that question, and I feel disturbed asking it. So, I mean, we have to get an answer. Once she's a toddler, we gotta see if she can run around with a knife and start chopping people's heads off. But a lot of you guys want Darian to go over to the other Mafia family and maybe take one of their family members out, if you know what I'm saying. I don't mean out for ice cream. I mean, lights out, bang, biggity bang. I don't know if you can say murder on, on YouTube without being demonetized, but bruh, we're gonna kill somebody. I don't know if you can say that either. Let's do it. So we really only know the head of the Escamilla family enough to invite him to travel with us. So what we gotta do is travel to the Escamilla family house themselves and maybe cause a little bit of a ruckus, but we gotta be careful. This is a mafia family. They catch us hurting any of their family members. We might be in some serious trouble. I didn't even do my hair today. I just, I just like ruffled it a bit and it looks like I did it. But if you look at the side, oh, it's flat as could be. But I made the front look good so I could do face cam. Consistency is the key to success. To the Escamilla family home. Okay, so Darian's rolling up on the Escamillas. He's gonna go knock on their door see who's home, scope out the situation, and then stuff's gonna get real. Okay, so knock, knock, anyone home? Come in, okay, well, we will. Okay, so obviously we can steal stuff too, and that might be something we do, because we only have $3,000 to our name. Now we're trying to see who is here, okay, and where their positions are in this house. Now it looks like no one's really downstairs. <sighs> So if we can find someone upstairs and convince them to come downstairs, we could probably easily kill somebody. Where is everybody? They let us into their home and they're not even home? I mean, it's a little rude and quite inconsiderate, okay? It's quite inconsiderate. Is that somebody? Where is everyone? I demand answers. I wanna know where these people are. I don't like being alone at other people's houses, especially when I'm trying to murder somebody. I don't know if he can say murder, so maybe I won't say it that much more. Maybe we'll bleep murder, and then you won't know what I'm saying. So every time I say m you're gonna be like, whoa, what is he saying? Why would he bleep a word that started with an M? Like m Why did he just bleep that word again? What is that word? If my editor didn't bleep the word, then you guys are like, whoa, what's going on? Okay, so I don't see anybody. No one's here. But we gotta let in. That doesn't make sense. Uh, oh, is that somebody? No. Where is everyone? Uh, hello? Darian Hayes, the mass murderers here. Uh, anyone? I mean, we're doing sit-ups in their entryway. Where is everybody? 
big people or big house problems. Am I right? Can't find anyone in the house because the house is so. Is that somebody? Is that an Escamilla? That is an Escamilla. Her name is Angel. Ha! She's about to visit the angels. Okay, I'm kidding. We're going to go talk to Angel and see what she's up to. Okay. She's uncomfortable right now. That's great, you know. <laughs> It's about to get a whole lot more uncomfortable, I'm not gonna lie. Chainsaw could be going through your head in just, just a couple minutes, so stay tuned. Okay, so here we go. Rolling up, man. We are rolling up. This is how you do it. You roll up. That's an enchanting greeting. I've never done that before, but it looks like she enjoyed it. So now what we're gonna do, well, be greeted by us. Okay, so we're gonna go to extreme violence. Okay, so what we're gonna do, let's, let's go to more choices. Let's, uh, uh, commit suicide. <laughs> that's not what we want to do. Why can't I kill you? You know, like that's what I want to do. Spread, spread money to clear up reputation. I could rage on her. What is that? Let's twerk for money. You know, see if she likes that. Who else is over here? Who's this? Who is this? Fozzy. Who's Fozzy? Okay. We're going to twerk for money. Working for money. I mean, I don't know what this. Oh, what the. Oh, I mean, I don't know what this is. I mean, should I? I need a picture of this. I'm not gonna lie, the sounds this guy's making is disgusting, but we made $200 twerking already, which is quite impressive. So, I mean, I can't knock it. Can't knock it. This guy's still watching. I mean, will he give us any money? Another $100. Dude, they're making it rain on us. Oh, yeah, $400 twerking for cash. These people are loving it, man. I, I mean, I don't know. Like, she's 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 loving it, too. Like, she's like, wow, that's that's quite cool. So, I mean, this is how we make our living now. Twerking for baby Rosa. Come on, guys. Okay, that's enough. That's not twerking for money. We got to go find someone to murder. And who is this woman here? She seemed to enjoy. This is Angel. Okay. I've already forgot who she was. Let's go to extreme violence and go to deadly interactions. Okay. So... No, actually, no, 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 no. Let's go to friendly and ask about her day, and then let's try to get her alone, okay? So let's go, now that we're chatting, let's go chat here in this courtyard, okay? Actually, yes, let's chat here, actually. Let's chat there. Okay, so in this little wood shop, this is probably the perfect place to commit the crime we're about to do. Okay, so we're gonna get Angel in here, and then we're gonna see how this goes. I mean, if she comes here, can, come, Angel, Angel, Okay, there we go. See, we're just talking. Let's uh, let's uh, express admiration. We think she's pretty cool. Okay, now let's go to extreme violence, <laughs> deadly interactions. So we've already chainsawed someone's guts. Let's uh, let's uh, <laughs> let's. Uh, these are all very graphic sounding. Let's um, hmm. <laughs> uh, let's slit her throat. That seems very dramatic. Okay, I mean, very dramatic. I can't do it. Should we do it? It's too late. Can't go back now. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh, she got up twice. That was the reflexes. Oh, Jesus. Okay, hold on now. <laughs> hey, everyone, stay put. It's picture time. Oh, Jesus. Ugh, that's graphic. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. That reaction when she finds out I'm twerking for money. Ah! <laughs> uh, take a picture. Why not? And then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I don't know why I'm laughing. It's very uncomfortable. Okay, so I mean somebody's gonna be in here any second, so <laughs> We're in a rival mafia family's home, so we should probably clean ourselves up just a little bit Just just enough to like not look like we just murdered her and now I mean there's nothing we can do uh, There's clearly a ton of blood here. Let's mop that up. I mean like what happened? What happened to Angel man? There's, there's no blood on the floor. I'm not full of blood. I'm not carrying a bloody knife. That's for sure Okay, so what we gotta do, we, we need to wait because we need this girl's... I want her urn. Come on, Death! Do your job, I gotta get out of here, dude. This is the Escamilla family house. They're gonna for sure... Oh, wait, 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 wait. We should get to know Death a little bit. Wait, Death, don't go anywhere! Cheerful introduction! You're gonna be working for me a lot, you know? Like, like we're gonna be close partners, so... You know, I'll give you a nice compliment, man. That's, that's pretty quick service. Great turnaround time. You really got that body out of here. Extreme violence. Can I murder Death? What if I... Raged on death. Don't do it. <laughs> That's not what we need right now. Let's uh, put this in our inventory. Obviously, this is our person's. Give me. Okay, stop chatting with him. I mean, stop it. Stop it. Okay, we made friends with death. That's great. We gotta take her thing. We gotta get out of here, dude. The Escaville family's gonna notice that Angel's missing. I'm assuming eventually. So if we don't. Oh my God! Look at this graveyard. Look at how many people the Escaville family 
have murdered. Okay, this is proof that you don't mess with the Escamilla family. But we're going to eventually have a pretty good uh, sizable grave collection too. Tombstone collection, I should say. And then maybe no one will mess with us. Look, if I lean like this, you can't see half of my face. It's like I'm hiding. What if I go over here? Now you can still see me. <laughs> what if I go over here? Now you can still see me. Okay. Well, just take your time to get home. It's not like the Escamillas are probably looking for Angel right now. You know, might as well just walk and stroll around. Okay. Okay, there we go. Goodbye. And we're back home. Safe and sound. And we have another uh, awesome grave to add to the collection. I mean, sweet. Right next to Marcus Flex. Okay, so does it say who this is? Angel Escamilla, Marcus Flex. Uh, we're going to engrave this one. We said don't mess with the Hayes family. You know what? We're going to say right here. Hayes, uh, no, wait, rest with uh, the angels, angel. <laughs> okay, so that's angels. And for Marcus, I gotta change his engraving. He never messed with us. So, uh, let's say don't flex on me, Marcus. Because <laughs> his name's Flex. Okay, so don't flex on me, Marcus. Or don't flex on... Let's go with don't flex on the Hayes family, Marcus. That's right. Don't flex on the Hayes family, Marcus. Yeah, I like that. And then hers is rest with the angel's angel. You know, hey, you know, no one said that we were good guys, okay? No one said that, okay? But what we do need in this house still to this day, okay? Let me show you guys. Okay, so watch. Okay, we have another mod pack installed. Something torture. What is it? It's a torture book. It's a book of torture. Ah, there it is. The book of chaos. Okay, so we're going to set this here. We got to give this to our lovely friend Darian here. So this book lets us do so many things. Like, so many. So many. That, like, that won't be a violent enough to kill him. We can still kill him with this book. But it gives us options. So what we really need in this house is a torture chamber. Because say we're trying to get information from someone. We need that torture chamber to really be able to get that information. Plus if we take hostages, it's a way to kind of let them know we're for serious. That they got to give us their information. And we also need a living room. So, I mean, I'm thinking of putting a staircase here. And then having a living room. And then like a hidden torture chamber that maybe Rita doesn't know about. I don't know. We'll have to see. <laughs> we can't let Rita find out what we do for a living. Because that would be bad. But Darian, you have earned yourself a serving of whatever this is. Fruit salad made by Rita. Go ahead and eat your fruit salad, my friend. Aw, oh, look at this. After a long, hard day of murder, Rita and Darian are just having some hugs. And Darian in his winter clothes just looks like a big nerd, dudes. <laughs> he looks like the biggest nerd. Uh-oh. Malcolm. Dude, Malcolm saw... Uh-oh. Look at this. What's happening here? Oh, man. They looked really mad at each other for a second. Who is this? You got jo Joaquin Le Chain and Joffrey Landgrab, okay? I mean, what we could do, let's just, let's give this book a test, okay? Let's, um, let's make a sim. Let's d d drown a sim and pee. Whoa, okay. Uh, let's, let's spread hatred. What does that do? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Did that make people mad? Look at all the kids that are mad now. Everybody. Oh my God, dude. This guy's fighting a scoutmaster now. Okay, hold on. <laughs> uh, let's make a sim pee themselves. Joaquin. Okay, he seems the most aggressive. There you go, Joaquin or Haquan or Weequan. You just peed your pants. How does it feel, dirty boy? Now let's maybe... <laughs> let's maybe uh, make a sim streak. Joaquin, see you later, dude. And he's out of here. Maybe he'll freeze to death. Who knows? It's pretty cold outside. If you look at the weather, it's chilly. We're only a few days away from uh, winter, too. So how's our baby Rosa doing? <laughs> Uh, let's do super efficient baby care. I mean, I don't know what that does. I don't know if that's like the total package. I don't know if we change her diaper and feed her. Let's, let's test this out. There's feed. There's a diaper change. Wow. Look at that. That was super efficient. Let's make a silly face. Let's rock and let's talk to her. Our baby Rosa. What's going on? Uh oh. Uh oh. Fight everyone. Dude, our wife, our wife Rita is so angry. What is she doing? Uh oh. Joffrey, run! Run, Joffrey! Oh! Rita did, did just, she is, oh my god. She's, she is, she is making people very upset here. Look, she wants to slap everybody. Oh, dang, dude. She just, okay now. Okay now. Okay now. I got, I got this. Don't worry, honey. Don't worry, honey. I got this. So what I'm going to do is I am going to, he just, you know, splashed up on my wife. So I'm going to go beat him up. Okay, Darian's gonna go beat Joffrey up because he can't slap. 
Our wife? Go there. Da da Darian. God dang it, dude. Come over here, Darian. And you're going to beat. You're going you're gonna to choke to death? No, you're going to choke them to death. No, okay. You're going to go. You're going to beat Jaffrey up, okay? Beat up. God dang it. Come over here, dude. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to click on Joffrey. We're going to beat him up, okay? Listen to me. Don't let him to continue to talk to your wife like this. Look at all these. Look at all these Joffrey land grab ones she wants to do. Like, she just wants to beat everyone up. Okay, so there. She slapped him again. They're like a slapping fiesta, dude. Beat him up. Dude, she's so mad. Okay, go back in the house, please. You're gonna get uh, in trouble over here. We gotta beat up Joffrey for you because we can't have this happening. So, okay, it looks like she's happy now. All, all that. We shouldn't, we shouldn't do the hex around our house because we're gonna just affect us. Oh, here we go. Yep. Yeah, Joffrey's wondering like, dude, what's going on? Uh oh, Rita's witnessing this. Wait, Rita, you were just beating him up too. You literally just beat him up. You can't be mad at us for beating him up after you beat him up. Now ours was a bit more violent, but oh my God, she's like, she's like, whoa, dude, that was. Okay, let's blow her a kiss. Let's see how this goes. Okay, <laughs> had to make sure that we were still good. Let's recite some love poetry to her to really clean things up. And maybe tell her a knock knock joke. You know, like, hey, forget about us. Just beating that guy up until his face is bloody. Uh, what does this do? Someone will put them into a flirty mood. I don't know what that does, but let's do it. Oh, she's flirty now. Oh my God, look at us go, guys, look at us go. I mean, we did just beat Joffrey up, so we should go woohoo and celebrate. You know, she slapped him around a bit, we beat him up. I don't know what's going on with this series, guys. <laughs> this is the best of life they live. This is the Hayes family, and that's all I could say about it. Twerking for money, beating people up, Killing people, woohooing to celebrate. I mean, it's messed up. But guys, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you're new around here. Every like helps my beard grow even more. So make it happen, guys. And until next time, we're gonna take it easy. Live and squeezy. Thanks for watching today's video. Before we end, don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And also, you have chances to win a free stuff pack, game pack, or expansion pack every time you watch one of our videos. Just don't forget to like the video and find that secret comment and leave it down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.